quick demonstration of making plastic bag tubes. Uh, you're going to ask why, and I'll explain it in a moment. But the first part is uh, I've taken four, uh, I've taken a, a plain plastic bag, black plastic bag, you can pick up anywhere in the United States without too much trouble, probably most places in the world. And then I split it so that I got a total of eight strips. And you're looking at two of those strips and I'm sealing the sides of those two strips. All right, and <clears throat> I'll this is just for demonstration, and you'll see that I've got, you know, that it's now appears to be sealed. You're seeing some deformation, some wrinkling. Uh, I'm just using a plain piece of paper, actually. I'm using the designs for an origami helix, um, an or origami um, helix that what gave me kind of the idea for this. Now, from there, when it's fit, when it's finished, you get a plastic bag that's like this, a long tube plastic bag, not very significant yet. But the idea is when they're full, fill them up with hot air, and it should seal, which it does. I'm actually going to put some a fair amount of pressure on it. Okay, I can see where I didn't seal it right there and maybe here. So this is kind of like the, these are the weak points. I can see the weak points in the seam. Um, so I'll need to modify that a little bit. But the idea when it's done is that it will, um, these will fill if we're properly sealed. The hot air should be, uh, in a hot day, the hot air inside will cause, will cause the bag to rise. Actually, it doesn't look too bad. So, yeah, I'm getting a little, I'm getting a little light leak or a little air leak right here where I overcooked the seam. So I have to repair that. Um, but when it's done, I'll show you the the end product, which hope, hopefully will be something like like this, where I have two basic tubes, two basic tubes wrapped around each other in a helical shape um, and hopefully with a little glue and a small generator when these spin in the wind minute moment when they spin in the wind they will do what helixes do is catch the wind in every direction I'm not uh, this particular design is very basic, but uh, same idea, origami DNA helix, helixes tend to spin in whichever way they receive the wind. So putting two plastic tubes together like that, they should spin in the wind. Maybe, hopefully, even generate a little electricity if connected to a generator. So um, that's a little Sunday morning sinus for you, and uh, we'll be back with... Uh, the rest of it here in a little bit.